In this session, we'll look at the feedback report in more detail. Remember, as we saw in session seven, the feedback report has three main components, performance, narrative, and trends scores, commentary, and rating highlights. In practice, these elements are closely intertwined in the report. The report starts with a summary of the assessment that presents the ACT rating as well as key takeaways. This is a section that might be presented to a senior executive or to an investor. The report subsequently expands each of the scoring components in further detail. A template for performance where the exact score of each indicator and each module is presented. This allows the company to understand in fine detail where they performed well according to the assessment and where they have space to improve. A template with feedback on the narrative scoring. Again, detailed commentary by the assessor is provided on six criteria. Transparency, business model and strategy, consistency and credibility, reputation, business risks, and maturity of climate integration. This reports what aspects of the data and information gathered were considered for the narrative score. It also provides relevant feedback for the company, which will have an opportunity to comment on aspects of the feedback report. This is a template for trend scoring, which will have text describing positive trends and associated drivers, negative trends and associated drivers, and a conclusion warranting the trend score. Whenever it's considered necessary and beneficial, the feedback report could extend into further detail on specific indicators, narratives, or other aspects that might have decisively influenced the ACT rating.